So I'm here with Niall Gibbons, the Chief Executive of Tourism Island. Welcome, Niall. Thank you for joining us. So tell us, what have been some of the highlights for Tourism Island in 2022? Well, thank you very much for having me. Great to be back at World Travel Market here in 2022. A huge crowd, a great buzz. And I suppose the real highlight for Irish tourism is that we're back with a bang. Uh, if you were standing here six months ago, we would have predicted maybe a 60% recovery on 2019 business. I think we're looking at at least a 75% recovery in 2022 and a really strong prospect as we look towards 2023. And sustainable tourism has become really important to travellers and to destinations. Could you tell us about some of the initiatives and maybe some of the attractions that really tap into this? Yeah, I think sustainability is really now at the core of Irish tourism. We've had a working group internally in Tourism Ireland for the last two years working on the whole uh, sustainability proposition. Uh, our Ireland.com website is now populated with a lot of content on sustainability. Our minister is going to be putting out a new policy on sustainability in the coming six months. And we will be launching a three-year strategy in January for 2023 to 25 that will have sustainability at the core of what we're doing. And there's a number of dimensions to that, by the way. I mean, first of all, you've got economic sustainability. I mean, this is about an export industry. This is driving export earnings to sustain local communities. And that's where social sustainability comes into it. Uh, and really that underpins then the, the whole environmental sustainability. And all those things go really together. So you've got the economic, you've got the social and the environmental. And talking about the future, what's the prospects for 2023 for the tourism industry in Ireland? We're quite excited about 2023, uh, delighted to be back here in 22. Uh, as we look to uh, our air and sea capacity, we're really encouraged next year. I mean, that's a leading driver of demand for Ireland because we have to get here 90% by air, 10% by sea. We're looking at new routes in the United States like Cleveland. We're also looking at restored routes from places like Chicago into Shannon. Uh, we'll have at least 102% uh, of our capacity uh, over 2019 in the winter period heading into 23, and the summer season looks like it's going to be even stronger. So great air access all around, really strong sea access, but pent up consumer demand. All the research that we've done in our markets abroad to date is indicating that people cannot wait to get back to Ireland and we can't wait to roll out the green carpet to welcome them. And on that note, what's your message to the audience here at WTM this year? If they could have one thing that they took away from Tourism Island, what would you like that to be? Well, we've had our biggest ever industry delegation coming here. We have 100 enterprises on the stand. Very simple message. Ireland is open for business. We can't wait to see you. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Niall. Thank you very much indeed.